I am back outside. Obviously the winds are picking up. I'm trying to upload my other video right now. See how that goes. It's on my phone internet. It's like 3% done. Usually it takes me a few minutes. Uh, let's see if you can see those clouds moving. How quickly they're moving. I don't know if I can like make it so. Yeah, see how fast? It's kind of hard to see because they're not that defined, but kind of trying to show you. Well, this is where we're at. We got about another hour or so before it should really start hitting us hard. Uh, and the ditches is pretty, like the swale, the ditch, whatever you want to call it, it is pretty full already. Um, we don't have to worry about flooding too much. I mean, maybe our street will some, but um, like as far as around our house, we're nice and high up and we're not in a high flood zone at all. So. Yeah, this is uh, part one of the next part of uh, Hurricane Ian. Yep. All right, so winds have once again picked up. I'll show you my neighbor's roof. You can really see the look there. Here they come again. Like you can really hear that coming. They'll rain too this time. Still trying to upload my other video. Hopefully it'll do it. The screen hit your phone is so bad. Yeah, I know. We're all out here looking at it in the front door. Oh yeah, there you go. Good shot for you. Uh, Ian is about probably about 30 to 45 minutes away right now, like of it uh, of the eye hitting hitting land. I guess from what my husband is saying, I'm not sure if it's the eye or just the edge of the storm really getting in here. We've had the storm here, so I think it's the eye. What he meant, but yeah. Get a little more of the winds if it picks back up. Let's see here. Yeah, I got Should be in a minute. You can kind of feel when it's going to be different. The trees up there are big. Moving. We're back. It's getting a lot worse. Still not scared of being in here, but... uh. Definitely getting worse right now. I'm waiting to get this wind, you just missed it. Of course, as soon as I stopped, it came back. Here it comes again, I think. Yeah. See some of this. On its way. Because it comes in bands. That's how hurricanes work, so, yep, there we go. Yep. <laughs> You can hear the jovial conversation right. behind me. I wait more because I feel like there's gonna be one more good band to show. Yeah, there you go. Wind is headed. You're gonna see a lot of the same shot because I'm not gonna be stupid about this. Hello, Ian. I've already got a tree down. I don't know if I can show it. It's over there. A lot across the way. So back so that Ian is getting here in full force right now for sure yeah. show you a different angle real quick but not for long because that wind is literally smacking me up oh, there's a tree right there that looks like it's
think it's ready to fall. Yep. And that one's gonna go. This tree over here is really bad. It's gonna fall. I hope it doesn't fall in his house. Yeah. That one's not gonna make it. Those invasive vines, like, don't help it. They actually make it worse because the trees are, you know, native to Florida. And then when those vines climb up it right there, they, they cause trouble. You can see those vines on everything. So, invasive species really, really stink for sure. Yeah. Still trying to upload that video. I'm at 85%. We'll see. So Ian is really here. Cool. Getting there in full glory. Just taking a picture. Or a little tiny video. Uh, to see what's down so far. The basketball hoop is broken. It's snapped. Um, not too much more though than that right now. Like, see? Wind's too bad to take a video that way. You can see that tree, how it's looking. I know. Yep. What's happening right now? Alright Ian, you can leave now. This is... Hurricane. Hello. The hurricane. My son is... Look. There, there he is. Alright, look at that candle. Daughter's over there. It's a light. The lights are still on the bed. Just gonna let you hear the noise in the room. Power's out. Those ones are real. There's Ian. Uh, uh, pretty powerful right now. Checking. I've been talking to some friends, and a bunch of them have uh, down fences and roofs. roofs and lots of things. So I'm gonna shut it up because it's starting to make my ears pop. Pressure is always really horrible. And yeah, sounds pretty terrible. It is. Um, you see all the trees swaying. They're starting to fly in a little bit. Not bad. No, no rain in those to this uh, at the porch area. Nice and but we're shutting it. So here we go. Just gonna let you see the door and listen to it. That's what it sounds like to be in the hurricane. So this is what it is. There's not a lot we can show you because it's not safe at all to show you. But you can hear it. Again, some more sound. It's just in our, in our bay window. Just to kind of give you an idea of what it's like. Mm -hmm. 
Can't see anything in the back, but doesn't look like there's any screen damage yet. You can certainly hear that noise. Can't see it right here, but we can see our bamboo going nuts. This is the window that faces where the storm is coming in from, like where the winds are hitting us hardest from. Um, I just hear them. Storm shutters obviously don't allow any viewing of it, but that's good. I don't want that right now. But a lot of wind and a lot of rain. There you go. Little bands, you can actually feel its own. It's pretty crazy. So it's got to reflect on it. Sorry. Here is Hurricane Ian. We're looking at him from our front door. I know this is the main way everyone sees it, but um, it's the only one we can see it right now. It's not safe to go outside. It's not safe to go near it. So those are the big old pine trees. Pressure is insane right now. You know, you cannot convey that here, but you might be able to with these trees up top. This little guy is in our kitchen window. Look at this sweet guy. Poor guy. Stay safe, buddy. Stay Hi. safe. Sir, 
Yes, here's a now lizard. I told him to stay safe. You can hear that wind, it's in the window come. Her daughter's room. It is insane out there right now. This is the only way to record it safely though. We've lived in Florida long enough to know not to be a complete idiot. This is recording from our son's room. You can just hear it too. Not, not as well because hers, just the way her window is located. Yeah. Certainly praying for everyone here in Florida right now. Truly. Some of those gusts. Because we've got 150 to 155 mile an hour wind gusts, or winds that are sustained, and 190 up to 190 mile an hour wind gusts they've recorded. So, this is a big bad storm. Praying for you, Florida. So, obviously, it's a lot worse right now. Are you recording? Yeah. It's a lot worse right now. You can hear it. Trees are sideways. They're on top of each other. I'm going to get through a band. I'll try to show a little more. I'll go to this side. Maybe you can see over here. Tree snapped over here. Not good. Okay, yeah, he's good. The road is a river. I'm going to try to zoom into it. can't even see it right now thank god and we're in the high area actually oh florida we're praying for you that's all i can say you can hear this let's do the down power line right there that's what's swinging that this area right right here There's those winds. It slowed down to five miles an hour. Uh, it had slowed down to seven. Now it's slowed down to five. I was able to sit next to my front door and finally get a text from my family and get a call out to them because they were like, what's going on? So yeah. All right. Going inside. I see this wind gust again. Gotta record this. I'm going to see if I can call Rick out here. Shut the door, please. Come out and shut it. Dang. Alright, so it's almost 9 o'clock. They actually took the wind advisory off here in uh, the town we live in, which is quite humorous if you can see this. Do you see that squiggly? That's, that's wind and rain. There's a little bit of rain in the air, but right now there's not that much. Um, but they actually took that off. There's still a flood warning in effect until 1045. Storm has stalled out to um, five mile an hour per, five mile an hour winds right now, Ian has. So it's just still sitting over us, just dumping this water, dumping these, dumping this wind. There you go, there's a nice gust for you to see. You can kind of see it. It's just that you gotta like make it focus. You can't really. Just doesn't even know where to look. It's just so much. We don't even know where to look. So, but you can hear that. There's the rain. You can see it. I know. Uh, probably not the most fun angle, just because 
in the front of our house the whole time, but that's the best you can do in something like this. We need to be slightly safe, so try to focus in on our palm community. Like, I can't even do it. Poor thing. Oh, yeah. We just talked to a friend and more roof damage and that kind of thing, so we'll check out ours tomorrow. Obviously can't tonight, so yeah, more coverage if there's more stuff. As you can probably hear, I think, um, <clears throat> we are still very much in this storm. It's about 9.25 right now. Um, we're supposedly going to be done with flood warnings and everything within like the next hour and a half. Um, I don't see that happening really, honestly, because it is still very much a big storm. I'm sitting in our son's room right now to, I'm um, just take a quiet minute to, well, as quiet as I can get with a category, who knows what at this point outside, uh, hurricane hitting, but yeah, Ian is still around us um he's like i said a little bit ago um because i keep doing this in segments he is still going about five miles per hour um we never saw the eye of the hurricane usually there's like this column and then another section um a lot of times depending on where you're at in the hurricane but this time we were on the we knew we were going to be on the side that hit really hard but we were on the side that hit really hard and it stayed that way the entire time and it's still there so we're still dealing with all of that because of how it hit so basically we got that strong the strong sustained winds they stayed the entire time and we that's we never got any peace from it at all there's been just relentless winds and rain the whole time um we to have no idea what's going on with our house yet and um, now it's dark so it's gonna be hard to see um, but hopefully in the next hour or two the winds will have stopped so we can go out and actually look at some of the damage that we've sustained and that kind of thing and figure it out um, but you know we're still very safe and um, we're tired you know like I was up I was up most of the night last night just you know, everything was abnormal. The dogs wouldn't, you know, one of our dogs wouldn't stop whining because it was storming and she's afraid of storms. And, um, you know, um, I just, we had everyone in our room, everything in our room. We had our own little, like, nose arc going on. Uh, and so, um, we, we were dealing with that. So, um, very grateful to have that and have that opportunity, have that space and have that safe place. So it is not a complaint anyway but definitely uh, definitely made it hard to sleep and just the fact that the hurricane was coming um, you know I wanted to make sure that we saw what was going on um, as much as I could live and uh, soak in all that electricity because uh, definitely an appreciated commodity in Florida when when it goes away so yeah I'm sure I'll have some more to say when the storm finally passes but um it is not there yet, so you are seeing me by a little camping light, you know, that is uh, what we're using. So I don't even know where to look because I can hardly see anything. But um, yeah, that's going on. Here's what we're dealing with right now. I'm walking out on it because it's not terrible right now, I guess. Down trees my ass. We'll have to fix. Big old freaking wind still. Can't really see it even. I got my fence in my neighbor's yard. Part of it. should grab the panels but honestly I'm just too tired at this point. We'll grab a mother and fix what we can and just look a little further back here. Yep. Good amount of fence damage. Uh, I don't know if that's a hole or what. I 
can't tell. I have no idea what that is. Yeah, here's our house right now. I really don't know what that is. It looks, looks like a hole. I have no idea what it would be too. None. All right, it's not safe for me to be back here. I'm going back in the house. The winds are picking up again. It's just hurricane in Florida. No idea what the heck that hole is though. The car looks okay. Ugh. Stinging rain. All right, night. So, fence panels, uh, solar panels, uh, what? I'm good, I can take it apart anyway, whatever. All right, part of our deck. Oh yeah, so we got. That's not so bad, I thought one of the oak trees fell down. Uh, We've got two solar panels down. Trees down, obviously. A lot of our, a lot of our fence, most of it. You know, but again, we are not, we are not hurt. We'll get all our debris out of our nature. Oh, there's our well equipment. Yep, I was worried about that. Yep, that's okay. We'll get it. Okay. You know, it's all over here. Thankfully, the way it was, our neighbors is okay. Thankfully, but we have all well right. equipment down. Fence and well, the well equipment took out our fence. Yep, the well equipment took out. Around, yep, out it took out our fence. We were trying to figure out what that noise was. Took out some plumeria right there. Huh? Yeah. Yeah, pretty wrecked our. All equipment. Great. No. Yeah. I know. It's really bad. Oh, even that. Holy cow, that whole thing moved. Yeah. Oh, wow. It was a Category 5 hurricane almost, so. We had Category 5 strength winds. We just didn't have them sustained. We just had mainly four sustained winds, so. Oh, this all fell down. This is all here. Yeah, these I, are all I, here. I probably slot that one back up. These are all here. Are you recording? Yeah. These are all here. <sighs> you know, our house itself though looks good. It doesn't seem to have any real roof damage except now we gotta find out, we gotta be careful with power line. Um, go this way. Part of our fence over here. Yeah, I know, me too. And, uh, yeah. I'm gonna go out a little bit. Show some of our, our lake of our street. Yeah, be careful. Um, yeah. So we got generator right That's it. Oh, on the other side? Yeah, I got it Once again, I'm out here. I just want you guys to really get a feel with how dark it is after these storms for us. You know, just that. That's, that's over near... It's facing the way that like Jim Cantori's at right now. Just to give you an idea. Um, he's that way. You have uh, one neighbor that has a generator going, so that one's nice and bright at least, but yeah, it's it's been quite a quite a storm. We we did see some damage. Um, not the same amount that a lot of 
a lot of loved ones we know have done and friends and family and um, that kind of thing and we're waiting to hear in for more so yeah just wanted to give you guys an idea it's still nasty weather out here but it's more like a tropical depression with some tropical storm things I just finally got the video to upload completely uh, I think that'll be up in the morning I'm not sure I'll probably I have to assess the damage at my mom's house as well but hey my solar light just came on so that's kind of exciting actually you know it's like a little little gift so I talk about finding your smile and that kind of thing and I really do mean that like honestly I uh, I absolutely feel like crying and I will definitely cry sorry the solar solar light went off I don't know if it'll come back on it didn't get a lot of sun today <laughs> uh, but that's okay neither did we um, yeah I, oh there we go I uh, I do do feel like crying uh, for lots of reasons and everything and I think that's understandable and I'm sure I will um, but there's a time and place for everything and right now it is the time to see what I can do to help our family and uh, well it's time to sleep but also like it's time to see what we can do for our family and then help our friends and all that as well um, my husband's going to take some of the panels in the back down so we can go in and out our slider doors uh, and hopefully like lock the dogs in the back and that kind of thing so that'll make life a little easier but yeah it's been it's been a day and I hope you guys uh, appreciate the content and oh I don't know what that light was but that's not normal so <laughs> praying for them too um, really be praying for all of us it's been it's been a lot and it'll be a lot and we got a lot but we are as Floridians pretty uh, resilient people usually so um, yeah that's all I got to say about that for today I hope everybody stays safe I hope everybody's in you know where that it's affected with the storm and does well and are safe and know that they're cared for and we will be praying for you as you go through this um, and uh, just God bless y'all find your smile as always and let's see what tomorrow brings you never know what the day may bring bye